hello good morning all today in this video we are going to discuss about how to generate an external id for those records which is having no external id so if the record has been created from odoo backend that is if you generate a code or if you generate a record from the odoo backend definitely it will have an external id but for those records that you have created from the ui it won't have an external id so let's see how we can generate an external id for those records which is not having an external id so if i will go to our application that is hospital management so i will go to hospital management and if i remove this filter of the patient records you can see we have got around six records and in these six records this odoo meets is the only record that i have created from the code so if i open these record and i will just activate the developer mode so i will activate the debug mode from the url or you can just go to settings and activate the debug mode so as the debug mode is activated we have got the debugger button here and if i click on view metadata we can see the external id of this record that is xml id is om hospital dot patient xyz so if i go to the corresponding module in custom add-ons path you have got om hospital and then if i go to data folder and if i click on data.xml here you can see this is the code from where i have created the patient record so you can see the record id is patient underscore xyz and the module name is om hospital so the external id will be om underscore hospital dot patient xyz that is what we are seeing here as the xml id so for those records that you have created from the code definitely there will be an xml id that is external id so now if i take another patient which we have created from the ui so this is the subscribe channel the, this is the patient that i have created last day for making the video of how to work with the odoo mobile application so if i open these record and if i click on view metadata you can see that there is no xml id just a slash so like that you can see the same will be for the rest of the patient uh, the rest of the patients which i have created from the ui so if i click on view metadata you can see all the xml id is coming as slash where the odoo mates which is only the one record we have created from the code have the external id so let's see how we can generate the external id for those records so what you have to do is that this is just a simple tip suppose if you need to generate the external id for the patient subscribe the channel just click on these select this record click on action and just click on export so once you explore ex once you export the data system will assign a external id so i'll just select the id as the variable and if i click on export to file and i'm not going to open this file i'll just close it and i'll pause this window and i will open the corresponding record and if i click on view metadata you can see a xml id has been got generated so you can see export underscore hospital patient level so like that an external id has got generated now if i go to the next patient that is odoo xyz which is having no external id right now you can see it's slash i will do what i will do is that i'll select all those records at a time and i'll just click on export and then select a variable you can choose any of these not necessary to select id itself and i'll just click on export and i'll pause this i'll pause this and i'll just choose start from odoo xyz and if i click on view metadata you can see an external id has been generated the same will happens with the rest of the patients so click on view metadata you can see a xml id has been generated so this is a simple tip that you can use so there will be some use cases where you need to do customization from the front end suppose if you create a new group suppose the use case i will just explain the use case suppose if you create a new group from the ui suppose i will just create a new group so tester or i will just sorry i have to give application as hospital hospital management i will just give us the front office stuff front office suppose if i have created a group from the ui and if i need to assign this group to some menu the code we have to get the id so if i search for the id we won't have the id right now so if i go back and come come here and search for front office 
have the front office here and if I click on view metadata you won't have the ID so what you have simply what you can do is that just click on here just I will select this record and click on action export select a variable click on export so that's done now I'll pause these and if I check for those XML ID in the view metadata you can see an XML ID has been generated so this is the use case if we create an user group and if you have to refer this group somewhere in the code you can just use this tip so that's all about this video if you have any queries or if you have any suggestions or feedbacks don't hesitate to share us you can just comment it on the youtube or just directly send us over the email the email id is odomagegmail.com or you can connect us over social medias like facebook twitter linkedin etc so that's it hope you will offer the channel to your colleagues and friends and ask them to subscribe and support us so thank you